it's late again. I'm just kind of bored right now, but um, so I was going to do something with hot glue, but now I'm going to show you milky beads. What milky beads are? They're like um, just beads that you melt. They're really cool, actually. I love them, but I burn myself a lot. Okay, so it hurts though sometimes, but anyways, my next one. Okay, I'll just get them all over here for you. Okay, a lot. Alright, so I'm gonna show you all of the ones I made. It's really cool. Um, so I'm very crafty. Like I love doing arts and crafts. Like it's my thing. For your information, I'm 13. Well, 13 in two months. Okay. Now let me show you which one was the first one I made. I think it was this one. So this is one of the multi bead squares. If you can see that. This is I just got a bunch of random colors and I like that really. So it is really cool. I love it. And uh, you can make them to where they're like this side completely um, like melted or this side where they're kind of like you can still see the beads. But you can find these usually at Walmart or whatever store you go to. Uh, they're usually in the arts and crafts section or the toy section. You know, they are so cool. If I if you saw the bucket of how many beads of these I have. Now, can I have the little pigs that they come on? If you can see the pig or whatever it's called, uh, they're right here, and it works, you see, you just get a bead, and you stick it on here in the pattern you want, you can make letters, shapes, whatever you want, okay, so I already showed you one, um, then I made this one, a bead fell off, but they're really cool, you just want to be careful, you always, if you're old enough where you can use the iron, you can iron it yourself, but if you're not old enough, have an adult present pretty much at all times, even because I burnt myself and I now I have a scarred finger. It's not fun. Okay, then there's this one. See, you can make it to where it's pretty much completely melted, like this part. Wait, am I going wrong? Wait, um, to where it's really kind of like that part. Or you can make it like this part where it looks like the beads, but it's actually really fun. It's time consuming, but it's really cool. Okay, now let me show you this. Now, yeah, I know what you're thinking. Oh, this part fell off. No. It melted. The peg melted that area, so I had to just do it. I just had to make it where. You know. So I just got simple colors. You can do these all black and you can do them whatever color you like. For example, you can also make letters. Here's a letter out of a square. Here's a letter out of um one of these, I don't know what it's called, but here's one out of that. And then here's one out of this, out of a circle. They're really, really cool. I um I love them. And now I made this. It's a chocolate chip piggy. I just got bored. So I just, I got bored and I made it. I just scattered some kind of skin color, um, shaped ones. Then I just put some brown beads in there. And it is a chocolate chip cookie. I mean, it's awesome, right? So then, some I want to show you. Okay. I ordered, well, my mom ordered some big, some melted beads from Target that she thought were regular, but they were jumbo melted beads, right? like that. The melted beads, and the other melted beads are like super tiny. But yeah, so here's what it makes giant things. It's for six and up. Not cool, huh? No, no. <laughs> okay, so then I also made an L. Which is kind of rainbow. I think it might be backwards. I don't know, but it's kind of rainbowish. So it's it's really cool. See, yeah, it's rainbow. I love pink. I have the pink and everything. Oh, stop. Sorry, my dogs are running. Um. Then I made this. It's just pink, black, and brown. Um. It's just an octagon. I just made. I don't know. I really don't. It's just an octagon. And then. I made a little flower, a little rose. See, this is how 
the amount to be the little big guy is going to be that small, not this big, like small. But you can have a big size if your child is six or younger. It, it they can actually make it, and then you iron it, you know, stuff like that. But so that's my little rose. Now this is actually my favorite. I was supposed to bring a dog, but I messed up. I forgot. I forgot to use black beads. So that is a little dog. It might be Nico. I don't know. But she does have a pink collar on her now, so that's kind of a clinky. But yeah. So here it is. You can see this side is straight and this side is curly because I didn't melt it all the way. But yeah. So these are really fun to make. If you want to make your own, just look at your lo local store, um, look in the either arts and crafts section or the toy section, but it's really fun. I guarantee you will have an awesome time making them and then melting them and stuff. So, they're really, really cool. Um, okay. Awesome. Just buy it, and, you know, if you get, they're, I think they're like, okay, they're like 10 bucks a box. It depends on what kind you get. They have jumbo sets that are like 20 bucks, uh, but they are really fun. And then also, see, I'm really arts and crafty. This is an AMA for my sister. I'm not done painting it, but it's, it's, it like has an angle. See? So, if you can see it. it. So, it stands up. So, if you set it on a desk, it stands up like you can always see the A. You don't just, you know, have to hold it up like, like that. So, um, pretty much. Yeah, but ooh, I have to show you this. I just got these not too long ago. It's a solar monkey. If it goes in the sun, it dances like this. I got it at Dollar Tree, but I love it. It actually worked. And then I also got a solar outfit, and it was like this. Ding, 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 ding. So it's really cool. And yeah, they're like a dollar, but they actually work, and I like them because it goes like the ding ding, and then yeah, the ears go. But it's really cool. So watch my next video. I don't know what it's gonna be, but watch. Um, I don't know. Wait, wait. This is Sierra. She's my baby. She is how old are you? Two and a half months. Yeah. And she's just the cutest little thing. Oh, oh, you're going to fall asleep, aren't you? So this is Sierra. This is a video of me showing all my dogs. I have a lot of dogs, so. Hold on. Nico! Nico! Baby! Nico! 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 Sorry, I had to find her. This is Lily. She's an ear biter. So, yeah, this is Lily. Yay! Yay! Oh, Lily! Thank you. So, this is Lily. She's got a little avatar on her head. So, Crystal! I don't know, but yeah, so these are Crystal's puppies. She's a little weird. Yeah. Well, wait here and let me find her. One second, I need to get her. She went outside. Come on. Okay. <laughs> 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 
He's the cutest little thing. Hi, Nico. Hi, Nico. We just found him. He was a stray. He was super skinny. We just got him. He's super skinny. He eats like a pig. And he's just the skinniest little thing. It's so sad. Look. Okay, you can see his ribs. Poor thing. Okay. So, all together, I have seven dogs, two boys, his name is Dexter, I have no idea where he is, he's probably outside somewhere, then Dexter is a mutt, a poodle, a poodle mix, um, then there's Nana, she is an Australian Shepherd, she's a big one, but she's really old, so she might not live in two more years, uh, cause she's about nine, Nine or ten. Um, we did have a dog named Kushi, but he passed away from old age. Uh, oh, there's Crystal. One second, let me get her. Okay, so I found her. This is Crystal. Say hi, baby. Say hi. <laughs> you rang me today. So she is a Bichon Poodle Milk Mix. Stuff like that. She, I think she's got a little bit of Chihuahua in her. Um, but yeah, she's, she's an awesome dog. She had five little puppies. Um, they're, they're all so cute, but they're all gone. Uh, Lily and Sierra were her puppies. Um, okay, where was I? Nana. Yeah, we did have a dog named Kushi, but he passed away of old age. He was, um, I think he might have had a little bit of golden retriever, but, I don't know, uh, Chow, I think. Um, then I have a dog named Roxy. Uh, she is a Belgian Shepherd. Uh, she's a very pretty dog, though. And then there's Crystal, who is a mom, and right now she's feeding her puppy. But she's an awesome dog. Then there's Nico, who we just got. He's the cutest little thing. Uh, he's a boxer puppy. He's cute. Um, uh, then there's Sierra and Lily, their sisters. They are Bichon Mutt Poodle Mixes. They're just awesome. So those are my dogs. I'll have a video next week and show you how to do some stuff with hot glue.